Good evening, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live. And uh, real quick, I've actually been busy putting together videos on Patreon today. We've uh, we've loaded two more. Uh, I think they'll be a real blessing to you. And especially the latest one I did, uh, this is just to give you an idea, Kings of the East. And uh, eventually we'll have that over on Zanun Institute on our YouTube channel there. Uh, that's a shocker. I was actually being asked by uh, people in the Pentagon about the Euphrates and about this particular scripture here in relation to some of the intel they were sharing with me. And I haven't even shared the intel yet on uh, on Patreon, which I will. That'll be another video separate from this one here. But I think that's going to be a blessing for you over on our Patreon channel. I'll put the description, put that in the description below for you. Um, also, I did another one on the sun, uh, some very unusual things, probabilities that they're anticipating on that. And I still yet have another one to do uh, about the serpents. An attorney friend of mine, uh, Steve, uh, sent me a, a link to something I want to share with you uh, about uh, serpents that they put on the, I think it's on the Travel Channel unusual events that they have there I want to share that with you because I also know about what that really is so before I get before we go any further though let's go really quick though I want to share with you some updates about uh, the situation going on in the European theater uh, this battle is really spiraling completely out of control uh, the NATO is pushing Russia to attack the United States that's what it really comes down to and um, uh, I was in a meeting yesterday, and the discussion about that was, where is the battle going next? And they're telling you in mainstream media that uh, Russia is arming its, its, its missiles with nuclear warheads. That is not true. Uh, but that information is to help get more money sent into Ukraine. Not that we haven't already sent enough of the of the uh, billions of dollars to Ukraine already. In fact, I don't think that the way it was put to me that we have sent more money to Ukraine than any other nation as far as uh, in a wartime posturing there. I think there was 37 billion already sent to Ukraine and Zelensky is asking for another 10 billion. That's not enough. Got to have more money, right? So they... They give you the propaganda, the lie that uh, Russia has armed all of its uh, are all of its missiles with nuclear warheads. Now, and I'm not saying though that Putin hasn't brought out Satan too and said that he's that he may use it. Um, yes, he has, but it doesn't mean that all of his missiles have been armed with nuclear warheads. Uh, Russia though will use nuclear weapons if it has to. It's just definitely not going to play around. But what I was told though is that right now they are doing. Uh, scenarios with the AI system. We have every world leader we have a database for in the uh, AI intelligence system that, that the government uses to try to predict what that world leader will do in response to whatever is going on at any given time. And lately they've been analyzing this when it comes to Putin. And because we know that Putin is being pushed into a corner, as you see in the article right here, on Sunday, January the 1st, 2023, Germany takes the lead of NATO's highest readiness military force, placing thousands of troops on standby and ready to deploy within days. Well, it's this type of actions and also the fact that we have sent unbelievable number of arms into Poland, preparing a war against Russia, trying to provoke Russia into attacking the United States. But according to the AI system, Putin will not attack the U.S. first. It would first be nations such as England, Germany, uh, Poland, and not necessarily in that particular order. I could certainly see Poland being one of the chief orders and even Germany because our forces are there. So Putin would have to do a major strike if he expects to get an upper hand. Now, I've already mentioned over on our Patreon channel, I think we did a video over there already. In fact, maybe what we can do is go ahead and jump bump that one up to a public video now. Um, 
where we were looking at the situation in, um, uh, uh, let's see here, let's see, let's see. Uh, uh, will Putin use nukes first of the year? Right, that is uh, still enlisted. We're going to go ahead and move that one to a public video over on our Stephen Benoon channel. There, this is where I was first told about this that they were they are pushing Putin to strike against the United States. All right, now and of course they have the Trident submarine off the coast of the United States. Uh, there is a there there is a lot of concern that Russia has the, everything within striking distance of the U.S. But in the latest update I got, they do believe, according to the AI system, and again, that's probability, that is not guaranteed the way it will go, but they believe that Putin will soon strike NATO forces, uh, and he's going to be forced into it, and it is believed that he may do a preemptive strike. And we're not talking about nuclear weapons, but in a way to cripple NATO to keep them from getting an upper hand against Russia. Um, we know that Putin has been trying to avoid all of this. He's asked many times to come to the negotiating table in this war, bring this to a close. NATO refuses to do so. They want all or nothing, and Putin is not willing to budge either. Uh, so... According to the New World Order agenda, it is to cripple the United States. So this is why there is a provocative measures from NATO's part, but it will also affect Eastern Europe, or excuse me, Western Europe, uh, in the case of Germany, England, uh, and Poland. They will all be affected first uh, and foremost when uh, all out, uh, you know what, breaks out over here inside of Europe. Um, it's a very troubling news to hear, friends, and of course, but what is this? This kind of goes along with the video I just did over on Patreon about the kings of the East. They are devils. They are demonic entities. They are the three unclean spirit-like frogs. What are they doing? Gathering all these nations together using miracles and wonders and things like that to bring them down to Armageddon. you got to see that video. It's an amazing video. Uh, and again, it will go public. A lot of times I make, not everything from Patreon I make public, but uh, but I would say at least half of the videos we do make public over on our Stephen Benoon channel. But this one here will end up loading on Denoon Institute of Biblical Research. It is a teaching video as well. And maybe even here on Israeli News Live through our iConnectFX.com channel. So subscribe to all those channels there. You want to be a part of that. Uh, we thank you for listening, and also thank you for your support. We need your support. Can't do this without you, friends, so your help is greatly needed, and we appreciate that. Uh, just visit us, IsraeliNewsLive.org, and uh, you can do this by mail or online. Online is much faster and easier. Just click that little button right there under Donate Online. Donate to however God lays it on your heart, whether it's five bucks or whatever the case may be. Your support is greatly appreciated. Or, Denoon Institute, P.O. Box 156, Sunbright, Tennessee, 37872. You can also make the checks out uh, under the name Stephen Benoon, B-E-N-N-U-N. And we greatly appreciate your support and your kindness to the work we do. God bless you and have a great night.